Um, my name is Valentin Lopez, and I'm the chairman of the Ama Mutsun Tribal Band. And our tribe is comprised of the descendants of the indigenous peoples that were taken to missions San Juan Batista and Santa Cruz. Well, Horshatuhi Kanakra Kats Vince Medina. So, hello, my name is Vince Medina in the Chochenyo language, which is my family's language, the native language of the East Bay. I am the project manager with Semper Virens Fund, the land trust that owns this piece of property where the Robert C. Kirkwood entrance facilities are being built. Today we're at um, Castle Rock State Park and uh, they have a new park entrance that they're developing. As part, part of that entrance is there's a, um, a native garden that's going in here. And today we have native stewards from our tribe. Uh, we have other um, associates with our land trust out here and we invited the public to join us. I'm really happy to be here during this, this, uh, this event to see our native plants come back and come, come back strong. This is the gateway to the Santa Cruz Mountains, the place where um, people are coming up from the valley and it's kind of a transition zone between our busy lives and daily activities to this opportunity to step into the wilderness and be out in nature. Our creation story tells us that we have a responsibility to take care of Mother Earth and all living things. And for thousands and thousands of years, that's what our ancestors did. And then came the horrible time in our history of the mission and the Spanish period, the Mexican period, and then the California American period. And we lost contact with the lands. And we were unable to do the ceremonies to take care of the lands, our food plants, our medicine plants unable to take care of the wildlife and the rivers. We know it's an old area where, um, where Ohlone people have lived for countless generations, too many generations to ever count. And we see why, you know, when we're up here in the mountains, we see how beautiful it is and how many resources there are. You know, this is people's home. The creation story tells us that we have a responsibility to take care of Mother Earth and all living things. And we have to get back on that path. And. Uh, when we're here, we come with a lot of respect, a lot of understanding about that, and a lot of care about making sure that these native plants remain a permanent part of the landscape. And today we're you know, putting the plants into the ground and uh, preparing the garden for the future. In three or four years, this is gonna be a magnificent garden that uh, you know, lets people know that the native people are still here. These are what our native plants look for. It will also have an education program to let them know you know, the purposes of the plants, where they use for basketry, for medicines, for foods, etc. Mm -hmm.